Welcome back to trigonometric function graph part 3. In the previous videos, I've talked about the sine function and the cosine function. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. In this video, I'm going to show you how to graph the tangent function. Let me show you the unit circle again. All station to central. And the tangent function is positive in the first and third quadrant and it's negative in the second and fourth quadrant. Apart from that, 1090 and 10, 270 is actually undefined. Let me show you why. If you have a look at this triangle, the tangent 90 degrees would be the tangent of this angle. But the opposite of this angle is actually the same as the hypotenuse of the triangle, so that's why it's undefined. And tangent to 70 degrees is in the third quadrant, so that's why it's also undefined. So the graph will look like this. It has two asymptotes in 90 degrees and 270 degrees, and you can see that it's positive in the first and third quadrant and negative in the second and fourth. And as we go on, the graph will repeat itself every 180 degrees. And the tangent function has domain of all real numbers. Except odd multiples of 90 degrees. Such as 270s, 450s, and of course 90. And the tangent function is different to the sine and cosine function because it has a range of all real numbers instead of being in between of 1 and negative 1. Also, since negative 10x is the same as 10 negative x, it's an odd function. Okay, that's it for the tangent function. If you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.